Hello, my friends, and welcome back. Japan is back in business, but it's not back in business in a good way, unfortunately. It's back in business for the wrong reasons. <laughs> so I have an article here, and uh, I will read uh, the article, and we're going to discuss how did they get to this. This article comes from Reuters from May 15th, 2022, and this is the title. Japan April wholesale price soar a record 10% as Ukraine war keeps energy costs high. All right, so Japan uh, jumped, prices jumped 10%. Uh, it says that, uh, and a weak yen pushed up the cost of energy and raw materials. So since the yen is weak, why is it weak? Is that because of inflation? What was it? I, I don't know. We'll find out, I guess. The surge in the corporate goods price index, CGPI, which measures the price companies charge each other for their goods and services, market the fastest year-on-year -year rise in a single month since comparable data became available in 1981. So all this uh, CGPI for uh, goods uh, and services mark the fa fastest year-on-year -year rise in a single month since comparable data became available in 1981. I had to say it again. The gain followed a revised 9.7% increase in March and was higher than the median market forecast for a 9.4% increase. The yen-based import price index jumped 44.6% in April for a year earlier. Monday's, that, Monday's data showed a sign that yen's recent declines are inflating the cost of imports for Japanese firms. Soaring wholesale price are likely to put upward pressure on Japan's consumer inflation, which currently still remains below the central bank's 2% target due man mainly to weak wages and household spending. Well, 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 this is, uh, I would say, part of the, uh, the truth or reality or reasons, because, you know, uh, Japan... Um, was very uh, tough and considered to insert and decided to insert itself in the Ukraine-Russia uh, issue, war, whatever it is, without having anything to do with that. It was on the other side of the planet. But because it is uh, has to follow some uh, scripts written by Zimbabwe from across the uh, Pacific, wink, wink, uh, it uh, embarked itself uh, in a very uh, slippery, slippery slope, and uh, here it goes uh, with the Japanese people having an economic uh, maybe disaster pretty soon because their governors, the govern, the, the govern uh, Japan, decided that they will impose some sanctions on Russia and start, you know, going around uh, uh, Southeast Asia and Europe to try to bribe countries with investments if they would join the club and all that. These are just, you know, metaphorically speaking. And uh, then came to Europe, and Europe's, I think the Prime Minister of Japan spoke even with the Pope, the Pope, and they talk about Ukraine. <laughs> all right, so uh, this is another example in my assessment, my poor and humble assessment, not uh, that this is another country that shot itself, boom, in the foot, like European Union. Not United States necessarily, but European Union. The country who I think benefits the most, the most, or is hurt the least, these things hurt the least, benefits the most, is the United States of, of America. That is it. And 
I'm here, so <clears throat> I feel so happy that I have Joseph Biden as president and Kamala Harris being the vice president and all these guys defending me from evil and protecting me from inflation and uh, you know uh, high uh, consumers prices and uh, you know the gas and milk jumping and electricity everything is great here everything is great greater than ever been ever been but we have to be careful what we say though and how we say it because it's never been like this ever here from what I heard and what I felt through my own experience. But it's not about this great country here, which is still, I think, a, a great country. But uh, uh, the way I see things going, I don't like the direction it's going, but what can we do? Uh, maybe share the news with uh, you guys and try to uh, connect and, uh, you know, uh, make sure that uh, we are people who are still using this instead of uh, other, uh, I don't know, hair or whatever in order to uh, reason that's why i would like to thank you very much for being with me again today and i'm sorry for japan very sorry for japan thank you for being with me again today stay strong stay smart look for the truth and be just see ya